I'm going to play a game of solitaire for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you're new to Siamese Mahjong, there is a link in the video description below to a demonstration and a link to the rules because they've been modified for two players playing two hands at one time. It's very challenging and a lot of fun. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. All my tiles have been mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. I'm going to deal the tiles now. Player one will get 28 tiles. Player two will get 27 tiles. We'll look at each player's hands, see where the strengths lie, and we'll hopefully be able to pick out a category to play. Because you have so many tiles in your hand, you might even be able to pick a hand to play right from the onset. Everybody has their tiles. Let's see what we can do for player one. Okay, here we have jokers. North, west, south, north, south. Dragons, including a pair. We have Cracks with two pair, twos and sixes. Here we have a pair of fours with dots, and then we have bams with a pung of sixes. If these were your tiles, what would you do? This is going to be a challenge, but I think what I would do is go for a quint with sixes and dragons, and then maybe play wins. We have joker bait to help with wins, twos and fours. Maybe we could play news with fours pair hand. We'll just keep the pairs and see what happens. Discard those. This quint is the fourth one. Sixes with the dragon for the missing suit. We have crack, bam, dot. And we can use these. We're one short of being set. We'll see what happens. I was thinking maybe we could play a news year hand because we have one, two wins and then maybe play three, six, nine with the rest. Maybe we could hold the nines and the year tile and discard these to start. Let's do that. Three, six, nine potential if the quint doesn't work out and then Maybe a news year hand. So we have plan A, plan B. Plan A is news pair hand and a quint. Plan B would be news year hand and 369. That's good. Five discards options. Let's see what we can do for player two. For this player, we have flowers, winds, including a pung of yeast, a couple dragons, cracks, singles, dots, pair of fives, bams, singles. No jokers, 
I would consider maybe playing a quint. Flowers, east with fives. And then maybe one, two, three consecutive run. There is some three, six, nine potential in here. Three, six, nine, three, nine, three, six. So let's just pull it together. I would hold these for potential news hand, news concealed. So we have a potential quint with no jokers. My signature move eventually will get jokers. Then down here, three, six, nine. There are eight tiles, including a pair. Or we could do one, two, three consecutive. That's why I have these pulled together. We could even maybe do a year hand because we have nines. So let's hold the dragon. We'll get rid of those three and see what happens. Quint, plan B, news. Three, six, nine, consecutive or a year hand. So we have four categories. <laughs> So we're going to use this to mark whose turn it is. We'll start by discarding for this player. Let's keep that red dragon. Maybe we could do like numbers with sixes and dragons. We're going to discard seven crack. Red dragon. That's joker bait. We can hold that. Let's discard seven crack. Seven bam. Six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's just hold those and get rid of five dot. Five, bam. discard. We got an east. News with fours, maybe. Let's discard five, bam. Two dot. Okay, that might help with year tiles. Let's discard seven, bam. Joker. Okay, this hand is set. Quint, Kong, Quint, ready to go. Let's discard seven, bam. Flower, that's a keeper maybe. We have three, six, nine and year tiles. We have more year tiles than we do three, six, nine. We'll see what happens. Let's, um, let's see here. Maybe we could share these flowers and play the first year hand. Two, two, zero, one, nine, one, bam, nine, dot with the flowers and hold that for joker bait. Let's just see here. Three, six, nine. Three, six, six, nine. Let's discard. We were gonna do maybe one, two, three, but we have no multiples with one, two, three. Let's get rid of the three crack. Hold on to joker bait. Hey, bam, that's joker bait. Let's discard red dragon. One dot, now there's a multiple in there with year tiles. I would switch to a year hand. Also, this player discarded a red dragon, so this is not good joker bait, unless we use it for the dragon year hand. 
Let's get rid of threes and sixes and focus on year tiles. Specifically, we could play the very first hand or the second hand down. Let's see. Two, zero, one, nine. Second hand down and use the flowers up there. Or we could play the first hand, two, zero, one, nine, one, nine, joker bait. Let's get rid of the red dragons. We do still have some consecutive potential. We'll see. Eight, bam. Oh, we have a pung in there now. Okay, so let's see. I still want to go for this quint. We were thinking maybe to switch to a year hand. That's why we were keeping the one. Let's go ahead and get rid of the nines. Now this player has to decide if they want to commit to this hand with that nine dot. We need four flowers for a quint. So maybe two zero one nine two one nine. I don't think I would commit to that. This player discarded it. If they draw it again, they'll discard it and we can change our minds later. Let's discard or let's draw. We have to draw. We were thinking about taking it. So let's draw. Good thing we got a joker. If we're playing a quint, we need jokers. Let's discard red dragon. Eight crack. Okay, now we could do eights up here. Let's discard nine bam. So we could do pairs of eights. And I still want to do this quint. Red dragon. Three crack. Six dot. That could be joker bait. Three, six, nine. Let's discard six bam. Here, we're gonna quint. And we'll discard eight bam. Eight dot. Green dragon. Four bam. We got a flower. Maybe we could use that if we switch to news concealed. Let's discard one crack. This is concealed. Joker. We need that for this quint. Let's get rid of the threes. Last house, second wall. We got a six. This hand is ready to win on a white dragon or a six. Either way. Since we have eights and fours, we really don't need twos. West, we'll keep it. Discards three dot. 
Eight crack. If we can just get eight dots, there's one out. Let's discard two crack. Seven crack. Three crack. Three dot. Eight dot. Oh my gosh, we got it. We need an east and a west and an eight dot. Let's discard four bam. It's risky playing a pair hand. We have a ways to go. West. We're going to have to decide maybe switching to news concealed instead of the quint. Let's discard six dot. Four crack. <laughs> Green. Three crack. Nine bam. Let's get rid of six dot. That's a year tile. Nine dot. Here we need to decide. We have our flowers. We could quint the east and then we're one short for making that quint with fives work. We would have these as discards. Then we would have to recover with a year hand. 2019, if we take that nine, maybe with a joker and a Kong and commit to the second hand down, we wouldn't be able to, well, we could still Kong the east, but our fives would be needing a lot of work. So the other thing we could do is Pung and do 2019, whoops, with flowers. One nine. Get rid of these. This would be Joker bait. Maybe switch to news concealed. Joker bait, Joker bait. This is ready. Well, really, we have everything we need for that. If we do this, this hand is set. We would use all these, these jokers, though. Let's go ahead and take the nine and commit to this hand. We could still use these jokers up here if we decide to do the quint or play news concealed. So let's hold that and let's take, let's go ahead and take that pung. So this is joker bait. These are discards. We're going to commit to that first hand. Nine bam was thrown. We just discarded. It's his player's turn. Five crack. Five crack. One bam. We'll take it. We need help up here now. Let's throw two bam. West. Nice, we got it. Let's get rid of this flower. Now here, we could take that with a joker. Or we could take it here and use this in here and hope to draw a joker later. Maybe we could even make this a pure hand. Hmm. 
We could still maybe play that quint though. If they threw a flower, they're gonna throw more. Let's wait. Let's wait and stay flexible. Taking that Kong would actually make a winning hand, but we don't have to declare it. I wanna be able to, let's see here. If we were to take it, let's just take it. I changed my mind. This is a winning hand, but let's hold it and discard two dot. Because if we hold it, we could maybe do a double Mahjong or simultaneous Mahjong. So we threw a two dot, it's this player's turn. Five bam. Seven crack. Four crack. Eight bam. Two dot. Four dot. Safe discards. Seven bam. That's been thrown too. Nine crack. We have what we need there. Three bam. We need that eight bam in the east. Five crack. Five crack. Two dot. Nine crack. Nine crack. Seven dot. Wow, look, five, we got it. Okay. So <laughs> we need help with these now. Let's see what happens. Let's discard north. Nine bam. The eight dot is still around somewhere. Joker. Okay, we're, oh, we need help though with, we need flowers. They discarded flowers though. I think it's gonna be okay. Let's discard south. White, that's a Mahjong. There we go, Quint. Let's wait on it though. We'll discard four dot. Maybe we can do double Mahjong. Seven dot. Three dot. Flower. Very nice. Let's discard West. That was the last tile in the third wall. We should think about declaring winning hands because we're now going into the end game. Only hands that are declared have value. Four crack, the fours would have come in for this player. Six dot. Two bam. We got to think about this hand here. One bam. We're going to exchange our own joker. That's another reason why you want to not declare your winning hand because any jokers in those exposures are exchangeable. Now the quint is set. We'll discard west. Nine bam. 
six dot. Three, bam. Eight, crack. We still need that eight dot. One crack. Eight crack. One dot. These are safe. South. Five bam. Six crack. Here, I would not take it because we're playing a pair hand. There are winds out, but no east. You have to pretend like you don't know they're up here. So I would stick with this. It's only two away. So I would not take that. We need jokers regardless. So we're going to draw one bam, one crack. I would start thinking about declaring this quint. Hmm. Let's go one more pick. Seven bam, flower, one dot. Okay, one dot. You never know about this player up here. I'm going to declare the quint. So we're going to put this out. We're going to quint. And then we'll discard one dot. So we have a big hand out. We're one away from a pair hand. Green dragon. North, we'll keep it. We'll discard four dot. Eight dot, second one out. Two bam. Four dot. Two bam. Up here, we probably should declare this winning hand to offset that quint. Eight dot. Let's let's declare Mahjong on the year hand. And it's pure, by the way. So we'll discard one dot. Flower. We're playing a pair hand. Let's throw the flower. Here, let's Kong. Kong. And we'll throw eight dot. This hand is dead. So we'll now go defense. It's very late in the game. This hand is ready to win on an east or a five dot, one way or another. So we're going to draw. Now, we could maybe switch to all wins. Highly unlikely, though, at this stage. Three dot. Two crack. Seven dot. Three bam. Four crack. I think those fours would have been better. Four bam. Four bam. Mahjong, Quint. So 
so they got whoops let's see oh that's right this is player two so they got both mahjongs I put these in the wrong place okay wow they had all the flowers oh my goodness this hand was blocked because of the east so we have a quint and a year hand pure year hand so this was the second winning hand so I'm gonna bring in the other hand all right now we'll score This was an interesting game. Both players were playing quince. One player, no flowers. The other player, all the flowers. I don't know how often that'll happen. Also, scoring is a little complicated. If you have a set of tiles at home, practice playing solitaire so you can practice decision making for the game, but also you can practice scoring because it can get a little complicated. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules, may all your picks be keepers.